Yep, 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 yep. Blue Ranger here with a new video. Today, we're going to do a review on something that's actually very cool and I want it since I was a little kid. Today, we're going to do a review on the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the movie, Blue Ranger figure. Now, as you can see, it's only exclusive at Toys R Us. I had got this at Toys R Us. I remember I was just walking in there, just looking around, whatever. I don't know why. I just felt like a big kid that day. And, um... I was walking around and I see the Power Ranger area and I have eye contact the um, movie figures that I had sold the blue one there so I'm just walking around and it was like oh my god so it cost around like 20 something dollars I don't remember so yeah this is the um, figure from the movie the suit is a lot different I heard that in the movie this, this suit was a lot heavier than the one in the TV show, but let's not get off topic. That's not what we're talking about. So, we're going to do a review on this. Alright, so as you can see, we have a very close up of the uh, figure right here. It says the power is on, just like in the um, poster that you would see in the movies. Um, the logo, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the movie. And you have the picture of the Rangers, this cool picture right here of uh, Rangers. we got black, blue, pink, red, yellow, and white. Exclusive at Toys R Us, movie edition, Blue Ranger. And it's made by Bendai. And on the back of it, it's telling you the story, which I'm going to get into. The info on the Blue Ranger, which I'm going to get into. And... As you can see, it's telling you that you can uh, find more in store of um, Toys R Us. The rest of the figures, red, blue, red, black, blue, yellow, pink, white, and I have a news. But when I went in there, I only saw the uh, black, the black ranger, the red ranger, and the yellow ranger. I think um, the pink, white rangers, and I have a news, they come in different packages. I think these four came out first, and I think these are going to come next. I don't know how it worked, but I only saw these four in the stores. But anyway, so the story says, uh, When Lord Zen and Rita Repulsa released Ivan Ooze from the egg in which he had been trapped by Zordon for, for 6,000 years, he quickly heads out to destroy the command center. With the command center destroyed and Zordon dying, the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers travel to a distant planet to find new powers to help them defeat Ooze. They meet Dulcia, who was fine as hell, by the way, who bestows them the power of Ninjetti. The team of the superheroes head back to Earth to use their powers to save Zordon and the world from Ivan Ooze and his evil plans. And right here it has the info on the Blue Ranger. It says that he's a Mighty Morphin Blue Ranger. His name is Billy Kristen. His weapon is the Stegosinger and the Blade Blaster, and his order is the Wolf Ninja Zord. And it says that Billy is super smart, but in times has trouble communicating. He is sweet, good-hearted, and focused entirely on academics. Billy calls on his Blue Nin Blue Ranger powers to command the Wolf Ninja Zord with silence and strength. So uh, next, we're going to take it out, and this is what it looks like. I like how when they morph, the morphing scene, when they, uh, the belt buckle right here is still the movie morpher, which I also have, by the way. And instead of just leaving the middle diamond part blank, they decided to use the, um, put the, uh, the Triceratops coin right there. It would have been cool if they would have put, you can choose to put either the Triceratops coin or the Wolf Ninja's coin. Because in both movies, they had both on the front of their chest. But anyway, so. This is what he looks like out of the box. As you can see, his suit is completely different from the one in the TV show. The diamonds are a lot wider. They're longer instead of like shorter. Because in a uh, show, they were shorter. And the boots are a lot different too. Because they added the stripes. The blue stripes on his uh, boots right here. And the helmet looks a lot different too, as you can see. So that's the Blue Ranger. What he comes with is the holster, the Stega Stinger, and the Bleed Blaster. 
So let's put the holster on there. The blade blast turned tight. That's what she said. And let's get this stinger stinger out and have him hold it. And the Blue Ranger is ready for action. I remember in a movie when he was fighting, it was the part when he was fighting one of the um foot soldiers, the Usman. And the Usman like threw him down and he was just like, Well and he crashed into the wall and he was like, That does it and he just shoots out the Stega Stinger and he just shoots up in the air back to where the Usman were. And he asked him, he was like, Did you miss me? And he just knocks him down and they just splat. It was one of my favorite parts in the movie. So this is what he looks like with everything on. His arms can 360 angle over right here. So yeah, I like the figure. If I was to rate this figure, I would give it a 9 out of 10. A 9 out of 10 because they, I believe that they kind of missed out on the, um, the chest coin. I think it would have been better if they was to like add the chest coin into the figure so you can like choose between you know the triceratops or the uh wolf so i think that would have been cool but other than that the figure is actually nice so i give it a nine out of ten which isn't that bad well this is the end of my review i've never really done an um action figure review before but i enjoyed doing it and i hope you guys did too so yeah this has been another Blue Ranger video, and I'll see you next time. Yeah? Shakir. Oh, hey Zoran. Your job as MNPR Blue is almost complete. What? I mean, with the Blue MNPR, I barely went to any Comic Cons with it. I mean, already? The next challenge will happen. The next challenge. What's that? You will soon see. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ranger!